first thing you'll need to do is to log in and you need to create an account. Simply fill in the information. And once you've done that, simply go to downloads and select the 2015.2 Windows installation. Log in and then confirm your details. And then simply download the file. I won't be doing this because I've already downloaded the files, but once you do that, you'll need to extract the file you have with two times, once to uncompress it and then once to untar it. And once you've done that, simply go in the folder, select X setup. Take a little while to start, but it'll pop up before too long. Simply the supported operating systems. These are the licensing agreements. Here you'll do select Fado Webpack. Leave those the default here simply because I'm changing the path. Um, you probably won't have to do that uh, simply because of a setup. Personal preferences change it to all users, but you can leave it for the current user. In the summary.
once the tools have finished installing, he asked to install some cable drivers. I have already installed these, so it won't be in the video, but you can click yes to those. You need to select the free license. Click OK and close that if you want, but you need to select free license and connect now. That will require you to log in and confirm your details again. Once it loads, you'll need to go down with the Activate Node Locked License and select the Vada Webpack License. Then Activate Node Locked License. Sometimes, uh, with certain browsers, Vada will automatically detect that you have um, generated the license. In, in my case, it is not. Um, so, if you think it has, you can always go to the few licenses and check. But you can also download the XML file in case it does not. In my case, I have to close this. And go over to load license. But first, we should check this just to make sure. And then load the XML license. Go back. And we have the licenses we need. And your installation of Avado should be complete. So, if you do have any troubles with the license, it will be with simulation and synthesis. So, that's where you'll have errors relating to the license if you do have them.